Yep. Um, thought our guys responded really well um, coming out of halftime, defending. Um, you know, we talk about it, talk about it, but, um, you know, today we took a step when it comes to that. And I don't care if it's, you know, Hood's a Division three, three team, but they, they got guys that they can be Division one ball, ball players. Uh, they can score, they can shoot, they play really hard. Um, so I was really happy with our second half effort um, defensively. And offensively, I mean, we have a very unselfish team. We really share the basketball. I've never been a part of a team that had 28 assists in a game um, on – was that 36 field goals? Like, that's that's phenomenal. Um, so a testament to our guys and their character. And they love playing with each other. So. Yeah, our guys are pretty much trained, you know, to, to be ready. Um, we know that we can go deep into our bench. And especially a game like this when we need a, another – you know, uh, jump start, you know, with um, our defensive intensity, everybody's always ready to go. Yeah. Um, you know, I guess it's, it's the home atmosphere is, is always good. You know, we, uh, you know, the fans coming out and supporting and been playing in front of your, your family and friends is always really big. And of course, you know, this is where we shoot most of our shots. Um, you know, so we're going to learn how to take this thing on the road and try to have the same success. Well, we didn't make a lot of changes. You know, we played against a team that played zone the entire game, so there are going to be chances, more chances to have open shots if we share the ball. And we were sharing the ball really well, and we got really good open looks. And, um, you know, this guy, he was a recipient of a number of them. Jeff, for you, you know, yeah, um, you know, coach, he, he always harps on, you know, stay ready, stay ready every game. Um, I'm just coming, just be prepared when I come in and, you know, do the most for my team, whatever it is, if it's shooting, defense, assisting, whatever it is. The rhythm that you played in today was pretty sweet, especially in the first half when you came off the bench really injected. You know, there was kind of four minute three, which seemed like a fairly short period of time for the longest time on the team. But what was the rhythm that you felt today? Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm, I'm not going to stop shooting. You know, uh, coach always telling me to keep shooting, keep shooting no matter um, how much shots I miss. You know, every open look, that's a feet inside the three-point line, just keep shooting it. How much fun are you having? Oh, I'm having a lot of fun. Points. How much fun are you having? Yeah, it was a, I mean, it was a rough start in the first half, but, um, you know, the second half was really fun. I enjoyed it a lot with my teammates. <laughs> <laughs> From the unselfish perspective and the fact that so many guys are getting in and feeling invincible, you had, what, 12 different players yeah, we love each other so much. You know, um, the chemistry between ourselves is is out of this world. So we're gonna find we're gonna find everybody on our team, no matter who's on the bench, who's starting. Everyone's gonna get a, a good look at a shot, anything it is. Let's ask a question about Harvard. That's not an easy go. Yeah. Um, and what you're wanting your team coach to kind of stir up in a matter of a couple days before you go up there. Had a chance to speak with them. Right now. I haven't gotten a chance to uh, to watch them on film yet. I know that they've had a lot of success so far this year. Only lost one game. The Ivy League as a whole has done really well with Yale. I think only losing one game. Princeton is undefeated. Um, you know, Tommy Amick is a very good coach. Um, you know, we're going to have to have our defense travel with us. You know, we, we we have to take a step defensively. And you know, that's that was what I just told our guys in the locker room that, you know, we're going to celebrate this for tonight. But starting tomorrow, like we've got to get our, our mindset to the point of thinking about just getting stops every single possession on the defensive end because we're going to need it against against Harvard. Uh, Malik Mack is a local kid who I've, I recruited when I was at George Mason, who's their leading scorer right now as a freshman. He's you know one of the top freshmen in the country. So, you know, we're going to have our hands full for sure. Yeah. Good? Awesome. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank Have a good you. night.